ice when you go to Costco. I'm talking about making sure you have a good water supply. Talk about making sure you got something like a good Berkey water filtration system. All right. Uh, now, some would argue that practical preparedness that I'm talking to you about uh, demonstrates a lack of faith. I say no. It's the exact opposite. Practical preparedness uh, demonstrates huge faith because that means I actually believe what the Bible says. Amen. And the Bible says, though it may not be me, some generation of Christians is going to be here for that first three and a half years of tribulation. All right? Some generation of Christians is going to be here and see famine and see some hard times. So I believe it just demonstrates faith. Did Noah have great faith or lack of faith when he built the ark? Did Joseph have great faith or lack of faith when he actually laid up some grain? Great faith, amen? So why would it not be a great faith on our part to just be wise and just make some common sense preparations. Amen. Uh, and uh, not only is being practically prepared demonstrate faith in, in what God said is coming, but it's just wise. And did you notice that God never commanded Joseph to do what he did? That's right. He didn't command him to do it. He just gave him wisdom to do it. Amen. And I pray God gives us wisdom uh, on some preparations that we can make. God give us wisdom. And common sense. Now, I'll be honest with you. I don't, I don't know a lot about prep.